U Club Sunnyside Project is a student housing facility consisting of three and four story split buildings. 134 total units provide beds for 536 students. This 208,000 square foot facility contains an 8,300 square foot community center and state of the art fitness center, swimming pool, hot tub, outdoor community kitchen, and recreation center. This $38.8 million project was built on spread footings and slab on grade. The face of the building is a combination of brick, hardy panels, hardy lap siding, curtain wall, and storefront. The roof system that was installed was black EPDM, and the community center is equipped with an energy-efficient Mitsubishi VRF system. March Weston Company, working for project owner American Campus Communities, and in conjunction with Paradigm Architecture, Sixth River Architects and ABCWV member Allegheny Design Services completed the U Club Sunnyside project utilizing 15 different ABCWV members as subcontractors, material or equipment suppliers, and for design services. Following 14 months of construction, over 500 university students were delivered their new home in the fall of 2016. Your Eagle Award winner for category multifamily and condominium projects up to $100 million March Weston Company for the U Club Sunnyside Project. The Easton Compressor Station is a Columbia Pipeline site in which compression equipment, horsepower, and the re-automated reciprocating unit needed major facility upgrades. Bicon Services was unable to begin construction as originally planned due to air permit delays and incorporated a six-month accelerated timetable to complete the project to Columbia Pipeline Group's requirements. Additional requirements were added during the accelerated timeframe, making this project extremely time-sensitive in order to satisfy Columbia customers on the East Coast. The Easton Compressor Station contains two fully automated gas coolers, dual solar Taurus 70 turbines, new 125 DC and 24 VDC battery backup systems, as well as screw rotary air compressors and an air drying system. The project was completed one week ahead of the accelerated schedule in conjunction with design teams from GIE Engineering and ABCWV member Doddridge Controls at a total cost of over $3.5 million. Your Eagle Award winner for category Electrical Industrial Construction, two to $10 million. Bicon Services for the Easton Compressor Station. Moses BMW in St. Albans is the only BMW dealership in West Virginia. To keep up with updated facilities requirements for BMW International, Moses BMW was required to add on to the existing showroom and renovate the current service area. The entire showroom space was demolished and a 500 square foot addition was added to make room for the requirement of eight showroom vehicles. The build back included all new interiors with painted drywall, ceramic tile, and new lighting systems. The parts department and the new 11,000 square foot BMW service center were completed following the showroom addition. Persinger and Associates had to work diligently with owner Moses Auto Group and architects Bastion and Harris in order to satisfy the requirements of the BMW design team before construction were to begin. After seven months of construction and renovation, this $1.7 million project was completed and met all compliance requirements of BMW International. Your Eagle Award winner for category commercial construction less than $5 million, Persinger & Associates for the Moses BMW of Charleston project. Pinnacle Dermatology is a professional services firm offering both medical and cosmetic dermatology services as well as the most advanced skincare services available. Pinnacle's principals, Crystal and Chris Tawney, started Pinnacle in Lewisburg, West Virginia and quickly decided to expand its market base to Charleston. 
asking Swope Construction Co. to team with them to design and build a state-of-the-art dermatology facility to serve Charleston and the surrounding area. After selecting a site in Charleston's popular South Hills area, Pinnacle and Swope designed and built out a 2,800 square foot facility equipped with the most advanced technology available in today's dermatology field. Swope and Pinnacle worked with Williamson Shriver Architects in Charleston to design a facility restricted to 2,800 square feet with multiple exam and aesthetic rooms, laboratory, infrasauna, spray tan room, nurses station and other areas to comfortably receive and process patients as well as provide administrative services. The project's scope included complete demolition and the subsequent full interior build-out of the new facility. Swope and its construction team managed the project to Pinnacle's budget and met schedule requirements. Swope self-performed approximately 80% of the work, with the remaining work going to ABC WV members. After four months, Swope Construction delivered Pinnacle Dermatology with its second West Virginia location. Your Eagle Award winner for category renovation less than $4 million, Swope Construction for Pinnacle Dermatology's South Hills facility. In 2015, the Jackson County Commission, along with ZMM architects and engineers, entered into an agreement with Wolf Creek Contracting to serve as the general contractor and construction manager for the Ravenswood Emergency Medical Services Station. This new 5,379 square foot facility will serve as an office, living quarters, and maintenance areas for the emergency medical team, their equipment, and their vehicles. Project features include masonry veneer over block walls on masonry and concrete foundation, concrete slab on grade, wood roof and framing, metal roof covering, steel doors and frames and full plumbing, HVAC and electrical systems. Due to enhanced features and improved working conditions, the new facility will not only serve local citizens with direct emergency services, it will increase response time and increase the safety of residents in the area in need of direct emergency care. Following eight months of construction, this project was delivered to the taxpayers in the fall of 2015. This is the second year in a row ABCWV member, Wolf Creek Contracting, will be taking home an award for a public project built in Jackson County, West Virginia. Your Eagle Award winner for category healthcare related construction less than $10 million, Wolf Creek Contracting for the Ravenswood Emergency Medical Services Station. Operated by the Diocese of Wheeling, Charleston since 1965, Camp Bosco offers a wide variety of faith-based recreational activities for children between the ages of 8 and 18. This project included a 2,800 square foot addition to the existing dining facility including a complete commercial kitchen upgrade and a new 5,200 square foot two-story dormitory. Jarrett Construction Services mobilized in November of 2014 to begin the selective demolition of the existing dining hall to prepare for these additions. The dormitory structure was predominantly wood framed, but still used 10 tons of structural steel to minimize interior load-bearing walls and provide support for the hybrid trusses. The structures have the appearance of being wood framed, by utilizing a combination of structural steel, conventional wood framing, insulated panels, and hybrid trusses. The dining hall features large overhangs to match the existing structure, and the exposed beams of the dormitory accent the high wood-covered ceilings. This project was completed over a 15-month time frame and was delivered to the Diocese of Wheeling, Charleston in January of 2016. Your Eagle Award winner for category Other Construction 2 to 100 million, Jarrett Construction for the Camp Bosco Project.
U-Club Sunnyside, a student housing facility located on University Avenue in Morgantown, West Virginia, is receiving its second award of the evening. This award, for the major electrical systems package, includes the completion of all electrical wiring for the over 200,000 square foot, four-story facility. Tri-County worked closely with ABCWV member, March Weston Company, to deliver this state-of-the-art 536-bed facility to incoming students quickly and efficiently. Wiring for 134 total units, equipped with air conditioning, ceiling fans, dishwashers, garbage disposals, microwaves and washer and dryer units, was done alongside electrical installation of additional project features, such as a state-of-the-art fitness center, outdoor community kitchen, recreation facilities, and an 8,300 square foot community center. Enhanced electrical features include a fire alarm system, temperature control, and a card access system for students and staff. This project was completed over the course of three months and included a total of 34,000 man hours. Your Eagle Award winner for Category Commercial, Electrical Construction $2 million to $10 million, Tri-County Electric for the U-Club Sunnyside Project. The Concord Compressor Station, a national fuel facility, was a design-build project with Bicon Services acting as the general contractor. They were required to provide procurement and construction services for the entirety of the project. Some of the major advancements of this project include a new skid-mounted Taurus T60 engine with a C40 compressor, new DC battery backup systems, new MCC buckets and variable frequency drives for new ancillary equipment, and ESD expansion to protect new station perimeters, a fuel gas system, full automation of the new T60 unit, and state-of-the-art security and camera systems. This project also included several major environmental hurdles, including a requirement to excavate and install a conduit and piping duct bank through protected wetland habitat, for which proper measures and due diligence had to be put in place to maintain the wetland's integrity. This $908,000 project was completed over a seven-month time frame, meeting all critical milestone dates and under the anticipated budget. Your Eagle Award winner for category Industrial Electrical less than $2 million, Bicon Services for the Concord Compressor Station. The Dominion Lightburn Tank Farm is an industrial facility located near Jane Lou, West Virginia. This facility included a number of key elements and multifaceted components in order to be fully completed. During the initial phases, Bear Contracting had to work with their engineering team to find an alternative way of constructing the facility's foundation. Sandy material, not sustainable for the structure's foundation, led to the creation of a three-foot cutoff wall to increase the thickness of the slab ultimately creating the solid area for construction. This $2.9 million project utilized over 500 yards of concrete and included construction of multiple separation tanks, a compressor station floor drain tank, access roads, yard stone landscaping and sidewalks, electrical building foundation, electrical system conduit cable, control panels, and all piping between tanks, meters, pumps, and truck connections. Despite inclement weather, Bear Contracting, who self-performed 55% of the work completed, utilized multiple ABCWV members as subcontractors and was able to complete this project, meeting all critical deadlines in place. After eight months, the project was delivered on budget to Dominion Transmission Service. Your Eagle Award winner for category Industrial Construction less than $5 million, Bear Contracting for Dominion Lightburn Tank Farm.
The Monview Phase 2 and 3 development covers 65 acres of land in Monongalia County, near one of the fastest growing population bases in West Virginia. Project owner Monview LLC, along with a partnership from the Lynch family and Consul Energy, worked in a public-private manner with Kanawa Stone Company to add retail and recreational space that would serve the growing community and nearby West Virginia University. Working closely with project engineer, civil, and environmental consultants, these phases of Monview development totaled more than 1.5 million cubic yards of excavation on steep, rocky terrain. 75,000 cubic yards of undercut and backfill were required, along with a three-quarter mile, five-lane paved road with curb and gutter, pedestrian walkway, and new drainage features. This project also included site development for the new community baseball park, which now serves as a venue for both the minor league West Virginia Black Bears and WVU baseball teams, along with multiple retail and dining facilities. Construction management for these phases was provided by Falcon and inspected by Triad during the two years and two months of completion. This $10.4 million site work package left the newly developed space with astonishing views of surrounding areas. Your Eagle Award winner for category site work construction, all contract amounts, Kanawa Stone Company for the Monview Phase 2 and 3 development project. The City of South Charleston's Fire Station No. 1 is a 12,000 square foot facility with state-of-the-art equipment and unique design characteristics. Servicing the City of South Charleston, the facility houses three primary garage bays, along with a wide array of additional features. The primarily concrete, steel and masonry block building includes a full kitchen, laundry facilities, shower facilities, multiple office facilities, and 10 overnight sleeping rooms to accommodate a full ship crew. The building is designed to create an effective environment for 24-hour operations and the ability to serve the public and surrounding areas at a moment's notice. This $1.4 million project includes a number of additional unique features such as a glass exterior eyebrow above the center garage bay, curved metal roofing, a 30-foot tall training shaft situated in the middle of the building for firemen to prepare for various conditions, including confined spaces, and two rain garden areas on opposite ends of the building to collect roof and site runoff designed by ABCWV member Pterodon Engineering. This project was completed over an eight-month time frame and was delivered to the taxpayers of South Charleston in June of 2016. Your Eagle Award winner for category Institutional Construction less than $5 million, Persinger & Associates for the South Charleston Fire Station No. 1. The Evansdale Crossing is a 100,000 square foot, five-story facility located on the Evansdale campus in Morgantown, West Virginia. On-site construction for this facility began in April of 2014 and was designed and built to serve the growing student population of the WVU Evansdale campus, WVU engineering facilities, and to house the Reed College of Media, which contains a 10,000 square foot, state-of-the-art media innovation center. Additional objectives of this new facility were to provide closer dining options, university services, and commercial options to WVU students, along with additional office space for faculty. Located within the facility is a Tuscan-inspired food court with multiple dining options, a 13,000-square-foot Barnes & Noble bookstore, as well as offices for the WVU registrar, financial aid, and student accounts. The fifth floor houses a student lounge and juice bar, and the entire facility directly connects to the WVU personal rapid transit system. This massive steel-framed facility is centered around a primary stairwell with a bank of elevators known as a circulator, from which the rectangular building is broken into two sections. 
The exterior of the building is a combination of brick, limestone, and metal panels unique to the Evansdale campus. After 22 months, this $26.8 million project, designed by Strata under project owner Bodner Investment Group, was delivered to WVU students and faculty in the fall of 2016, on time and on budget, despite unforeseen issues and several owner changes during the various construction phases. Your Eagle Award winner for category Commercial Construction, 25 to $100 million, March Weston Company for the Evansdale Crossing Project. The CAMC Cancer Center is a state-of-the-art, multi-story facility located in Charleston, West Virginia that was built to serve numerous oncology services in the Kanawha Valley. The exterior of the project, which utilized nearly 1,400 tons of limestone veneer, showcases the quality craftsmanship put forth by ABCWV member Lang Masonry. Also showcased in their scope of work throughout this 110,000 square foot facility is a second story terrace with limestone walls, three elevator shafts, three stairwells, a rotunda with radius walls, and an open reception area with a fireplace that has exposed chisel face limestone soaring to the ceilings of the facility's grand entrance. The number of stones to track and sort poised a daily challenge that was handled diligently by the crew members through a coordinated schedule. Two crew members sorted through the fabricated stone to handpick each piece that would be installed the following day. This $2.1 million project was completed over an 18-month time frame and was finalized in April of 2015. Your Eagle Award winner for Category Exterior Construction, Masonry Precast or Stone, Lang Masonry and Restoration Contractors for the CAMC Cancer Center.